Hi y'all, welcome back to my channel. I hope that you're having a wonderful Sunday today, spending time with your family. So today we are here to look at the design team project that I did for Doreen at Ooh La La Vintage Treasures. And I had so much fun making this. And um, But before I show you that, I kind of wanted to show you the digital that I used. It's romantic. <laughs> romantic I can't even pronounce it serenade and she has the regular journal pages she has tall and skinny pages so and then the ephemera and I'm just gonna go through it kind of quickly so we have this lace one this damnisk look at that with the pearls and then this one and look at the map i love this map isn't that pretty and i have you high up so that you can see the project so i hope you're able to see the pages everything is so beautiful so how's everybody doing today I'm doing good. My fibromyalgia is kind of kicking in and I've got no energy, but my new refrigerator came this morning and that was good. It's cloudy out. I think we're going to get rain. So that's the tall and skinny pages. Perfect for a flip-flop journal. And then we have the paper pack. Some of the pages are, and then I'm, I've backed these. Can you see both of that there? I think I'm gonna okay so this is from not from this kit I'm almost positive it's from the winter memories kit same with that I'm pretty sure but you need to go to her Etsy and take a look at her digitals they are look at that with those pearls just gorgeous and I will have links to her Etsy and her YouTube down below I love this page and then we have some bows look at these suitcases and I don't even think I printed out all of the pages There's a whole bunch of these pages with the bags and then and there's pages with just the bags and pages like this. Isn't that just gorgeous? I just love those pinks. So pretty. I'm trying to think of a project just using the bags. Aren't those pretty? Oh, I love the blues. And the blues and pinks together. And then here's some words. And pretty blue paper. File folder. I need to back those. Some smaller file folders. And then the same thing in pink. And I didn't print out the small ones. And then we have ephemera. You can make a journal out of these tags. There's some big tickets.
so much fun. I'm, I'm getting ideas of what to do. And here's some smaller, regular size tickets. Oh, and there's those. I did print them out. And frames. And she has a lot of frames in this kit. No, maybe that's the next kit. My kits are running together now. Corner pockets with some ephemera. So I just love that. So pretty. Some tags. Some pink tags. Some ephemera and tags. Again, we got it in the pink. And then here's the postcards. Aren't these gorgeous? And I printed the ephemera on the cream cardstock, 65 pound, that you can get from Hobby Lobby or Michaels. I printed a lot, but I'm pretty sure I didn't print all of it. So I just wanted to show you the kit. I think I'll be making a journal with it. So here's what I made. Okay. It's going to hold laces that I've put on rulers. These are vintage rule, wooden rulers that I got from estate sales. And I got this idea from Doreen at Ooh La La Vintage Treasures. She did a video of how she does it a while back and you can get these rulers at amazon look how pretty the laces look on them especially when you use the pink pens <laughs> so here's the inside i line the inside and also have lace and then here is the lid with the flower that I made. The lid closed until I put this here, so it doesn't close anymore, but we have a handle here and lace going around and this beautiful digital. I hope you can see okay. And then the front, we have this digital. Oh, isn't that gorgeous little rowboat going under the boardwalk? So pretty. So we have lace here, and then this lace, this is like cherries with leaves, is what it looks like to me. And then we have this ruffle with silver going down the center of it. Silver tinsel. And I have that along the bottom as well. And then this is a clip-on earring. Can you imagine wearing these? But it's beautiful on projects. And then we have wedding dress here, a flower applique with sequins, and then we have a pierced earring here that's all bling. So pretty. And then on this side, again, all the ruffles and the pearls at the top go all the way around. We have this digital here. Just love it. Here's the back. And here's the side, the, the boardwalk. That's just so pretty. And then the bottom, the feet, you can get Tim Holtz. Oh, I didn't glue this on. Um, Tim Holtz has these feet, or you can get them from Timu. These ones are from Timu. The Tim Holtz ones that I had were are bigger, so I used the smaller ones. And then I just used my pokey tool to put the hole through the cardboard, and I just used brads. And it's the same color. And that's what I did for the handle. I used smaller brads.
should probably just glue that on. So there we go. That's my design team project for Ooh La La Vintage Treasures. And it's so pretty that the inside is lined too. So I hope that you enjoy this. I hope it gives you inspiration to make yourself one. It's going to be so pretty when it gets all full of laces on, on the, uh, I keep wanting to say yardsticks, on the rulers. When it's all full, it's going to be so pretty and easily accessible. Love it. Well, thank you for joining me. If you would, please like and leave me a comment. That would certainly help my channel grow. And if you haven't subscribed, go ahead and do that and click the little bell so you'll be notified when I upload a video. Well, thanks for joining me. Again, her information is going to be down below. Go to her Etsy shop. Her kits are reasonably priced. They're very good prices. And um, like I said, you can mix, mix, mix and match the kids because they are um, so pretty. They have the same color palette. You get that blue and that, or that blue, that pink and the uh, vintage uh, with every kit. So go over and check her out and I will see you in the next video. Bye y'all.